my second problem. One third of a number, which I'm going to call question mark, is greater than eight. So it's bigger than eight, but it is smaller than 12. What is the original number? Pause the video and tell your grown up what our new denominator is. What number are we going to be thinking about? Which times table, what number are we going to divide by? That's right, three. So in our bar model this time, we're going to be looking at threes. So let's have a look at this problem. So one third of a number is bigger than eight. So I'm gonna draw my bar model again. We all know I love a bar model. So here it is split equally into thirds. One whole one split into three equal sections. Now let's have a think about the question. They have asked us, or I have asked you, it's got to be greater than eight, but less than 12. Pause the video and tell your grown-ups which whole numbers this might include. Which whole numbers come between the numbers eight and 12? That's right, it could be nine, 10 or 11. It can't be eight because it's got to be more than eight and it can't be 12 because it's got to be less than 12. So it can be nine, 10 or 11. So if I put nine into my bar model, what could my original number be? Pause the video and have a go at working that out. Don't forget, we're counting in our three times table. So instead of doing three times nine, you could do nine times three. So count up your three times table on your fingers until you get to nine. Excellent. What did you get for three times nine? Should be 27. Okay. What if I replace this number with a 10 this time? So I have 10 plus 10 plus 10. Pause the video and tell your grown up what three lots of 10 equals. That's right, my number could have been 30. Well done. Mm, what about the last one? I don't know my 11's times table. Pause your video and tell your grown up or try and work out what 11 plus 11 plus 11 equals. That's right, 33, because I tricked you. 11 times table is really easy. It goes 11, 22, 33. And if you look here, we are adding three each time, aren't we? We've added three for this one because we've added one extra each time and we've added three here. So let's go back to our original question. One third of a number is greater than eight, but less than 12. What is the original number? Well, the number that is the third could be 9, 10 or 11. So your original number is either 27, 30 or 33. How did you do with those two problems, year one and year two? I hope you found them quite easy and I hope your grown-ups helped you. Well done and I'll see you again soon.